Hey everybody, welcome back to Bug Snacks. To this last time, hey buddy. we went through every area of Bug Snacks and caught every single type of Bug Snacks. So we have officially 100%ed the game in the sense of catching everything. Um, I ended up feeding most of the Bug Snacks to Philbar, as you can see clearly from the fact <laughs> he's got a cake for a nose. Um, but yeah, I just randomized it and this is what came out. So. Now we're going to go into the end game oh, wow. and it's find out what is really here. going on around here. I can't believe it. We got to celebrate big time. Towards the end of this video, this I do intend to start go over and spill the secrets. Buddy. So, are you sure you're ready? If you want to see, so yeah, if you want to see what happens, feel free to do the next part by yourself. But um, I'm going to go through and I'm going to tell you essentially what's going on. If you have not completed, yeah. So if you have not completed every single side quest up until this point which includes the ones I've shown you in the videos then do not continue until you've done so if you want the golden ending if you don't care and you just want to see the end of the game then yeah let's party the only quest you have this to complete awesome. are the ones where you get all the grumpuses back to Snacksburg awesome and then interview them all the once you've done all the interviews floor. you can end the game whenever you want so now we have to go and get this party started one who is me has foreseen the path to enlightenment. I'm sorry, I can't take a seriously with that loyal one. No. <laughs> it is a journey taken with the mind. I understand your wisdom, oh great Shelda. You're saying I should chug this snack water upside down, dog! Yes! Is that what she's saying? I'm a little confused, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> How's the party treating you, Baff? Hmm, I've seen worse. Yeah, it's really coming together. It's nice to see everybody getting along. <sighs> Listen, Philbo, I appreciate what you're doing, like getting everybody here. It's way less boring. Wow, she was actually nice to but him. These grumps aren't friends. They're just making nice because it's better than being alone. Sure, but who wants to be alone? <laughs> You're such a squeeb, but like in a good way. Aw, thanks. <laughs> I'm gonna hit the dance floor. Hope I see you there. So one of the grumps is now dancing, and if we head back just for a moment, yep, <laughs> he does the goofiest looking dance ever. So we have to get them all to dance, and they all have different conditions for doing so. I so let's talk about Africa first. Seven out of ten, which is pretty good, I guess, for Philbo. Me? Dance? I don't think this party could handle it. Besides, this isn't really my Not with a gummy bear teeth, they certainly couldn't. <laughs> Alright, so we need to get everyone to dance. Now I'm gonna go around and just do all the tasks. I'm not gonna waste time showing the cutesy stuff. Um... Prom though, why don't you go snack dance? Snack water! Get your snack water here! Fresh, organic, cruelty light! <laughs> what are you kidding? Hey, there's business to be done here. I'm not leaving this stand till I get some of these grumps to loosen up. So basically, yeah, this snack <laughs> water is kind of like an alcoholic beverage made out of pure red bug snacks, oh, yeah. which is kind of uh -huh. gruesome. But I mean, is it any worse than blending other foods together? A heart enraptured is mine. So it is. <laughs> One tears up the dance floor. Boogie boogie! <laughs> so there goes one of them. Chandler, why do you go we dance? I were throwing parties like this. I'd have come back weeks ago. Duh. You know I'm DTD. Down to dance. But I'm not hitting that dance floor without Snorpy. Also, yeah, if you haven't. Um, you can customize your grumpuses however you want, just make sure you've done everything you want to up to this point. I was worried at first, but this party's kind of nice. Even the little ones are having fun. <laughs> we'll make a party animal out of you yet, darling. Now let's work on your dance moves. Can I get those two to dance just yet? So the Osteoblast says, looks like the two of us are really boned. <laughs> <laughs> really, <bold. laughs> Yeah, Trophy, you're such a treasure. 
Oh, that's sweet. They really, they really like each other. I bet Wambus would go and dance if we gave him some of this. Uh, look at this. Uh, uh. Yeah. <sighs> Much obliged, stranger. I better talk to Gramble before I lose my nerve. Hmm, what's he gonna talk to Gramble about, I wonder? This party's a real hoot. Oh gosh, I don't know. I got two left feet. Wouldn't you rather hear about the captivating history of dance? I mean, I wouldn't. Just saying, I wouldn't. Hey, now, I don't want any trouble, Wambus. Gramble, I'm sorry. I've been rude to you, and even worse to your little ones. You... you're serious? No fooling? I don't tell jokes, Gramble. I am not creative. Oh, apology accepted! Of course, no forgiving is complete without a hug! No. But <laughs> I suppose a dance couldn't hurt. Yep, they're manly enough to go dance with each other. That's cool. So let's go grab Wiggle will dance, but she wants to sing as well. So let's go grab another stack of water. And we will oh, give yeah. it to her. Uh-huh. Oh, didn't even need to run there. <laughs> At last, beverage service. Now I can sing the night away. <laughs> and off she goes. Oh, <laughs> I'm just noticing good. they're all dancing. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Alright. You an apology, brother. My earlier insults were unnecessary. Your inventions are quite valuable in capturing research samples, and I appreciate that about you. Your apology is as lacking as your ethical standards, but it's a start. Excellent. Now that we are reconciled, I have a dozen research papers <laughs> that could use peer review. Flutie's not a it's horrible person, it's just they right really now. can't understand begin. people. And I take it all back. Be at ease. The party lights double as a wave inhibitor. This party is secure. I have something important to ask Chandler, but a certain annoying sibling of mine won't leave me be. You're interrupting personal business. Unless you have something intelligent to say, be gone. Rhythmic gyration has no purpose. That's it. That's all you get out of him. But we know oh, someone who That's likes to talk. So let's go talk to her. I bet Floofty will want to learn all about the Desert Empire's dance of certain death. Yep, so we'll give, give, if we give her a moment, she goes talks to Floofty. So you see, the desert dance mirrors the moves for hand-to-hand -hand combat against bug snacks. Thus, the youth were tricked into learning. Fascinating. Hiding why would they have to fight bug snacks? I suppose some of them are a little principle. aggressive, but why would they have to fight them? She says it. Trivini has convinced me of the historic and cultural value of expressive movement. Perhaps I should experiment. Phew! I'm all talked out. Makes me want to shake my tailbone. There you go. That's two of them down. <laughs> I love how he's, I love how Lucy's doing the robot. I'm sorry, I didn't know they did that. <laughs> my chance has arrived. Don't blow it, Fizzlebean. Okay. See what happens there. <clears throat> Chandlo, oh. I, I. Apparently, we have to be on this we've side. We've been together for so long, and I've always wondered how you feel about me. Do, do you want to be my boyfriend? What, bro? That doesn't make any sense. Oh, I see. Yes, never mind. F forget what I said. Snorpy, we've been dating for years. Wait, wait what? But how is that? Possible. Dude, remember that time we made out on that Ferris wheel and I said we should move <laughs> in together? Uh, well, well, yes, I, I just thought that we were roommates with benefits. You know I hate ambiguity. Sorry, Snorp Dog. Is that clear enough for you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I love you, dog. Now let's dance! That's nice. <laughs> so we just need, then there's two more to go, so we just need... Woo -hoo -hoo! 
So we just need to go get Befica. Me dance. Besides, this is. Yeah, I forget which song it is. You just have to keep changing it until. Excuse me. Ooh. OMG, they're playing my song. I'm gonna show them what a real party looks like. There you go. That's all the grumpuses we've got brought back dancing, apart from Crumdo, who now that everyone ah, else is dancing. Right, that's enough work. Now it's time to work the dance floor. Ding, 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 ding. No! Right, now we go to talk to Phil Bud, who's on top of the house that Liza Burton and uh, Agabelle live in. So let's head up. We did it, buddy. We're all together again. Well, almost all of us. Hmm. But you know what? Knowing Agabelle is out there gives me hope that Lisbert is out there too. I mean, none of this would have been possible without you, buddy. I know you have to go back for your job eventually, but I'd sure miss you if you left. And, well, you still need to interview Lisbert, right? So... Our end is nigh! What? End? Well, is, is that a metaphor, or...? Uh-oh. Are you okay, buddy? Uh, all right, I, I know this looks bad, but as long as we keep calm... Our doom approaches! Pray to your gods, children! Someone is panicking. It's the queen of bug snacks! She's rising from the depths to devour us all! The Grumpanati aim to silence us for good. Their machinations are coming to fruition! Now hold on, we're not gonna die because of some cult or monster. That's right. We're gonna die because the volcano's going off. That's right. Wait, what? Oh, it is? Bad timing. Suppose we're gonna end oh, up can't see it. like all the others, eh? Come on, bro. We can survive this. As long as we got bug snacks, we'll be fine. My barn collapsed! All of my little ones escaped! Bummer. Whoa, 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 we're homeless and out of bug snacks? Oh, it's a grumpy grump world now. <laughs> uh, dibs on eating Philbo. Please do. I'm quite curious to see the result. Will Befica turn into Philbo or the bug snacks he's eaten? Hold on a moment while I retrieve my notes. Hey, 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 don't give up yet. We may not have homes or snacks, but we have each other. I know it's pretty what scary right doing? now, but we can't fall apart. Think she every tired herself time out. Something bad happens. <laughs> We have to stick together. Well said, Philbo. Egabro! You're all right! Yeah, what get back in the circle, surprise. Philbo. Welcome back, Dr. Batanugget. Hey, everybody. Chandlo, Floofty, Mr. Troubleham. Doc? I'm glad you made it. Does that mean you figured it out? That's right, Philbo. I know how to get to Liz. That's amazing! We gotta go right away! Sorry to say it, but is now really the best time? This might be the only chance we get. Liz is in danger, and this disaster is only getting started. The worst is yet to come. So spills forth the toxin unending! Quiet, you! Doctor, you are only subjecting yourself to needless risk. Elizabeth is likely deceased. Dog, this bird is alive! And we're not gonna leave her behind. I just need Philbo mm. and uh, Philbo's buddy. Sorry. Yeah, a reminder that the reporter is unnamed at all times. <laughs> well, what are the rest of us supposed to do while y'all were gone? You prepare for the worst. What do we need right now? Well, I'm sick of being in the dark for one. I want to know what's out there. No worries, Beth. I'll build a couple bonfires, maybe a watchtower. Whatever's out there, we'll see it coming. But what do we do when the Queen comes to devour us? Well, I have a few prototype traps that I could put to use. How about the more practical threats? You know, the earthquakes, the volcanoes, and what have you. Simple. We find a way to get off the ground if the need arises. 
Well, none of that matters if I starve to death. We've got my sauce. Heh, <laughs> no way, pal. I ain't gonna chow down on that nasty plant goop. Mm. I stand corrected. No more concerns? Great. Let's get to it, then. Right, there we go. We have our mission. The hunt is on, as they say. <clears throat> so yes, as you can tell, this is where we finally find out the re what's really going on here. The reason behind Elizabeth's disappearance, the secret to bug snacks, presumably, everything. Also, no cuts this time. This time we're seeing everything through to the end. Oh, we still have our tools, so... Hey, Agabo, after we get Lizbert, are you two gonna come back to town? Oh, I don't know. I'm starting to like sleeping on freezing cold rocks. But I'm sure Liz misses our bed. Well, it'll be ready for ya. I've been keeping your hut clean for whenever you got back. <laughs> You're such a weird guy, Philbo. I think the idea is you can catch bug snacks, but you can There's no point in doing so. Hang on. I gotta try this now. Oh, looks like you can. Hmm. So there's no purpose in doing so now because there's just the, um, there's no side quests to do. Once you've activated this part of the part of the once you're in this portion of the game, you can no longer go back and complete side quests. This is it. This is, You're locked in now. You have to play through to the end. There is a way to come back and repeat this ending bit later if you really want to, but... Not doing that. Still tall. Oh, do you need a break? Uh, how about water? Let me check your vitals. No, no, I'm okay. Besides, we're, we're almost there. Right? Right. But in the future, you could stand to do some exercise or, or just hang out with Chandlo. Here we are again. Again, doesn't look ominous at all, does it? Hmm. Alright, we're here. Um, how do we get this thing open, Egabel? Turns out she wrote the order backwards. I guess even the great Elizabeth Megafig can still make mistakes. Well, <laughs> nobody's nerfigged, right? <laughs> okay, I'm ready when you are. We're coming, Liz. One, two, three! 